This is SAT test 7, non-calculator question number 17. College Board gives us a diagram and says MQ and NR intersect at point P. NP equals QP. So these two sides are equal. MP equals PR. So these two sides are equal. And they want the measure in degrees of angle QM. R. There are several ways to work through this. I'm going to work my way into this triangle and see what pops up. This angle that's 60 degrees plus the large angle here equals 180. Let's call this angle X. Since X plus 60 equals 180, angle X is 120 degrees. I also have two sides equal, so these two angles are equal, and let's call that y. y degrees plus y degrees plus 120 degrees equals 180 degrees, and I'll leave out the degree symbols from now on. 2y plus 120 equals 180, subtract 120 from both sides and I get 2y equals 60 divided by 2, and y equals 30. Angle y is 30 degrees, the value of y is 30, and they're asking for angle QMR, and that's y, so I have found the answer to their question. It turned out I never used that NP equals QP, and I never used that this angle is 70 degrees. They gave us extra information as a distractor. College Board does that on some of their questions. You should expect questions on triangles, including the fact that if two sides of a triangle are equal, the op corresponding angles opposite those sides will also be equal. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.